This is capitalism. I love this level. Because it is what it says on the tin. An interactive loss of will to live. By Goo Goo Gaju. Goo Goo Gaju. No icon. Easy, small, misc. Misc indeed. Hey, is that Bitcoin? Another exciting day in the life of Uni. Let's do it. Here's Uni's apartment. You can hear the sweet noises and the wind. Very nice, very nice. Do you need to use the toilet or something? No. Uh, I guess we go out. Don't even bother turning off the TV. No, time for breakfast, I see. Let's have breakfast. Yum, yum, yum. Time to wash up, I guess. Yeah. Here you go. And off we go to work. Time to go out into the world. Yeah. Can we go out this exciting way? No. There isn't a fire. Neighbors. Don't bother them. Time to go downstairs. To the lobby. Oh, at least she lives in a apartment with a lobby, not, not so bad. Hi there. Outside now. Here's outside. There's a bus stop. Almighty Zen tacos. Have to get in and drive to work. Yeah. Uni drives to work. Here we are at work. Need smart. Welcome to work. Hey, where are you running off to? Get this woman, she's a free thinker. Not that free. Here we are then. Hello. This register is now open. So uni works through the day. Ah, uh, I feel so accomplished. My life is so full of purpose thanks to these last eight hours. Eight and a half hours? Time to go. No. Don't don't even don't even think about approaching the pretty ladies. Going home now. Go get some dinner. A Z taco. In you go. Thanks. Uh, I'll have a number four, please. Taco time. Did I eat it or just buy it? Back out now. I guess I ate it at the register. Can I walk home? No, I cannot. Time to pick up some odds and ends you need. Drugs, indeed. That is the secret to survival. In. <laughs> Narrator is getting less and less patient. No. Hello, can I have my drugs, please? Okay. Oh, got dark. Who's that? Hello. Time to go home. What an exciting day we had. He drives home. Good evening. Time to go up this. aren't allowed to go on the roof. That would be too exciting. Back home. Well, I did already eat. Going to bed. Sleep time.
uni has a fitful six hour rest. Nice. Well, time to go to work, right? Well, time for some breakfast. Shove down the breakfast. Wash up while getting dressed and doing everything at the same time because you're late. Tie your tie while rushing down the corridor. Cursed existence when the elevator is occupied and you have to take the stairs. Run down the stairs so you get all sweaty and nasty in your suit. I mean, at least she has a car. She doesn't have to sit and wait for the bus. But yay, congratulations, you get to drive yourself to work. Wonderful. You walk inside, you're instantly filled with dread. You don't work in lightning. Lighting. You know this place way too well. Having wasted away so much time here. That last hour felt like it took forever. It didn't help that you were staring at the clock the whole time. You're so excited to go home, but, but why though? You're just happy to be out of there. But you've got nothing to look forward to, really. Maybe if you shove your face with tacos, you'll feel better, huh? Not really. Not really. Hunger is just a need. Tuesday is almost over. You spent the entire day dreaming, wishing for the weekend to come. Just to get a break from this freaking BS. Maybe you should look for a different job. But you're too exhausted to do that. We're just gonna go to bed. Uh, that was not enough rest to make the previous day feel worth it and to make me ready for the new day. But, God forbid you're late. Better head to work. Walking around with a zombie look on your face. Because you're on your way to work, so you really don't give a shit about anything or anyone. Unless they're gonna give you like a million bucks, they got nothing to offer you. Hey, look where we are. Yeah, 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 I'm here, I'm here. If only those eight hours could pass with a fade like that. I am jealous of this creature. Truly really a pleasure to just fade through the day like that. Eating out every day, isn't that expensive? Well, not really, because what matters to you is time, not money. You work 40 hours a week minimum. So you have enough money for whatever you want, you just don't have enough time. So you'd rather pay to have your food done than to waste your time making it yourself. You're definitely not gonna sit around and wait a long time for food to be made, so you're gonna get fast food. So you're gonna fill your body with more shit. And that's certainly gonna help the situation a lot. A lot. But what are you supposed to do? You enter your door and you're just exhausted. You're trying to find some form of entertainment. To 
make the day worth it. Like if you have something fun to do, maybe it's worth it, you know? But you're too tired to really do anything other than like crash and watch TV. Fall asleep. Just in time to do it all again. Ooh, is it Wednesday? Is it Thursday? The days melt together. You don't really know, there's no difference. Except you do know. Because all you do is just count down the time until it's Friday evening. And it's like you have years of vacation in front of you. That's how it feels on Friday evening. And then it's Sunday evening before you get to blink twice, but that's a different story. Hey, back at work. Now, I'm no communist, but there's gotta be a better way. It's crazy what they expect of you. It's inhumane. I definitely believe that 40 hour work weeks are inhumane. Not meant for humans. Not meant to be forced on humans. I mean, if you're passionate about something, you can work 60 hours and you're gonna love it, but we're talking about mandatory time, you know? After six hours of working, you think you're gonna be super productive those last two? I think not. Alright, I believe this is Friday now. You can feel it in the air! Isn't it wonderful? We all just live to count down the days, to try and fast forward through them. What a wonderful existence we have created for ourselves. Truly, we are the pinnacle of nature. On your way to work you feel like, okay, it's the last day of the week. It's almost over. And then I can relax. And then you realize when you get there that you still have the same 8 hours ahead of you that you just struggle to erase every single day. Doesn't really make it that much better that it's Friday, but of course. You get to exit out. At the end. And it's always so underwhelming because you've been looking forward to it way too much, because you hate your job too much. But you look forward to this so much that nothing could. like. make it feel like it lived up to the expectation, you know? I mean, what are you supposed to do? Friday is the same as any other day. You're too tired to really do anything anyway. Yeah, you can stay up a bit longer if you want, but still, what are you gonna do? Saturday is the only real day. Do you feel this instant <laughs> overwhelming pressure to make the most of it? Because, my god, this is what you were waiting for, for five long days. And then Sunday is just a joke. You wake up late because of what you're doing on Saturday, and then you have to go to bed early because... Sunday night is not really your time, you're already on the boss's time. Okay, I believe we are on Saturday now though. So I guess there's no weak system built into this level. I guess that's just that. What to do, huh? What's the solution to this? How to fix 
I wouldn't know. I can only complain. Well, I definitely think there are small steps we can take. Like six hour work days. We weren't there studies made that show that that was actually a better use, more productive? Like you get more done in six hours than eight, because with eight hours you're stalling and you're trying to waste time and whatnot. I think that will go just that. I mean, two hours less a day will go a long way, a long way to help out people. To bring back some humanity to this world. In. Not sure what that part is all about, really. I guess he wanted to flush it out with something more than just getting tackled. I don't think you go pick up stuff every day like that. That's a waste of time. And time is too precious. Except when you're at work. And then time is your enemy. It's just so crazy that we have such limited lives. Life's so short, you hear it all the time, you gotta make the most of it. But when you're at work, you literally hate time. And you want it to just disappear. You wish you could just shoot through it. Crazy. Well, I believe this is Sunday, so. I guess we're doing the full week. So this is what? 56 hour work day? Work week? Not a good idea. that someone made it. It's not really a fun level to play, I think. But, you know, you can do a lot more than just make fun things in KS. And I think the important with this one, the, the message with this one is very important. I wanna talk. Let me, let me have a life. No, no, time to go. Should be an ending after like the fifth day. Where she jumps off the building or something. Oh, wrong way. me go on the roof it's Sunday night it's definitely time to go on the roof and, and jump or you can do it Monday morning too I guess Well, that's capitalism. Not necessarily the concept, but the level. But kind of the concept as well. For a lot of people. I know that it's a great system for some. And it's much better than some of the alternatives, but yeah. Things could be better. 